In this video, we'll be learning how to work with background images. Let's have a look at a negative example. In this design, we have a frame with a form inside and a full-sized image. We want to avoid this for two reasons. One, in the design, it'll be hard to use auto layout as the image is treated as another layer and will stack together with the other child layers instead of staying in the background. Two, in the code, it'll be generated as an additional image element instead of using the background image CSS property for cleaner code. Fixing this is really simple. Click on the image and select the fill and hit Ctrl C or Command C to copy. Then click on the frame and hit Ctrl V or Command V to paste the image fill. You can now delete the unnecessary image layer. This results in cleaner code and you can freely apply auto layouts or constraints to make your design responsive. 